I am SimSweetie and welcome to part what I believe is 21, probably, of Let's Play The Sims 4 Get to Work. In this part, Lucia will be going to work and we will be going with her because she actually wants to get a promotion and, you know, her performance, okay, this is weird zooming in on her while she's on the toilet, but, um, since we actually, you know, kind of diagnosed people incorrectly, yeah, her performance is down pretty low, so we gotta work on that. <laughs> we do. But she is getting up and getting ready. Antonio is asleep. <laughs> Exciting. And Zoe is, she's actually just sitting here. She just finished eating her breakfast with Paisley, who I believe has school today. Yeah, it's Monday. She is only 25% done with her homework. Maybe she can go ahead and work on that if she has a second before she has to run off. And Lucia will be going to work very soon, but off camera I got some vegetable seed packet things and I planted a couple, so there's stra strawberry bush. Is that what I put here? I thought there were other ones. Did I not plant them? Oh, I must have not planted them? Question mark? I don't know what happened there. <laughs> I thought I put them down, but I think I'm losing my mind. Okay, well, you know what? We're going to plant them later. I, I could have sworn- I don't know. I don't know what happened. I had some right here and now they're gone. Where did they go? Who has my carrot? Someone took my carrot. Okay, anyway. We're gonna join Lucia. I don't know what happened there. Whatever. We're gonna just have to buy more seed packets. What can you do? Hopefully we'll get some money today from Lucia working and then Anthony's baking. Anthony, what am I talking about? <laughs> I'm so tired. Antonio. <laughs> ah, Antonio's uh, skill, baking skills up to like a level six. So maybe we'll start doing the bakery stuff again soon. Um, Paisley has school in an hour. We just got bills again, even though I literally just paid them off camera yesterday because they shut our power off. So I like had to pay them. But we just got him again, and I don't want to spend that kind of money. Alrighty, let's go ahead and take care of someone. We got whoever this is, Gavin right here. We'll go ahead and deal with him. We will go ahead and check his eyes. And solve him for a sample. And then you need to do the rest of the <clears throat> the rest of the things. Whatever I'm clicking here. Alrighty, and we will get that done. And then did I do what did I do? I don't know what was funny that I did. Um, how's it going? We need to perform a treadmill test, so we will find that right here and do a treadmill test with him. He's not looking too good, Gavin. Who's over here? Anyone? Oh, no one wants to be checked in right now. Interesting. I guess we just got here. How long does she work until? She works, in, she works until a five. Alrighty, we do need to diagnose one more sim for this kind of goal right here. So maybe we can diagnose Gavin and then that would be good. Oh, and Paisley is off to school. Cool, cool. Alrighty, let's do this. Oh, good. Oh my goodness. Is he okay? I mean, you're already at a hospital and you might have more head injuries now. I would be concerned. You okay? Oh my goodness. We are actually going to kill Gavin Richards. Is that your name? Oh, I was right. I didn't think that was actually his name. Alrighty. I think my voice is weird. I feel like I say that in every part, but in this part especially. Can we refer you back to the bed? Because, like, that's the thing you should do. Okay, we're going to put him back in the bed. Actually, we need to scan someone on the x-ray machine, so we're not going to do- Oh, I like his pink- pink shoesies. We need to actually go ahead and do an x-ray scan. This poor guy. Poor Gavin. He's getting tortured. Oh, we have some people here who want to check in. <gasps> I was waiting for the majestic music to end. We have a house call. Let's go do that house call. Okay, we're gonna bring Gavin back to the bed. We will give him an x-ray when we return. But for now, we have an emergency house call. Have you guys ever had a house call? Like a doctor that had to come to your house? Because I don't think that's ever happened to me. I feel like, I think I said this the last time that... What are we? No, we're going to the house call. I, I told you to go to the house call. Oh, don't we have to click up here? Yeah, we do. Uh, duh. If I knew what to do. Okay, we're going to x-ray him later. <laughs> don't we click here? I'm, I don't want to order anything. She wants to chat with Zoe. We'll have to do that. Okay. Why can I only order? 
Why? What is that going on? The door. <sighs> Why? Do I have to talk to her? I thought we just had to click on the front desk. Ah, what if we go praise her worth work ethic? Uh, we can't. Ooh, look who's here. Easton's here. Might have to come say hello to him. A lot of you guys really seem to like her and Easton together, which I was kind of surprised by because I thought everyone would be, like, furious with me. Well, I don't know. It's like, it's not letting me do it. So I guess we'll go ahead and refer him for an x-ray scan while I try to figure this out. Is it going to work now? Why are you not letting me? Right? Because I didn't read the thing that popped up, but don't you just... Why are you sitting down now? How long until I murder someone? A sim, not a real person. That would be a crime. There we go. Why can't we go on the house call? It's weird. Must be a glitch, probably, unless I'm doing something wrong. Oh, I figured it out. <laughs> I also yelled into the microphone. Okay, let's go ahead and scan him. You guys are like Macy. Macy, click on the desk. Macy, click on the desk. I was thinking you had to click on the computer. Sorry. I'm not that intelligent. Um, anyway, we're gonna go ahead and scan him real quick, because we already got him over here, and then we broke an x-ray machine. Oh no, don't electrocute him. Okay, well we did it, but I think we also broke the x-ray machine. Um, anyway, we are gonna go ahead and travel with her. Yes. And hopefully, because we've taken a couple hours, none of the sins at our house call are dead yet. That would be bad. That would probably not be good in our work performance. Because deaths are not good. <laughs> in case you weren't aware of this. Alrighty, we are here. Ooh, who's here? We got... Haven't we already... Didn't we already take care of this house? Maybe not. Actually, I don't think so. We got a couple people here. Including Cassandra, who used to be a doctor herself. Who was now a patient. How the tables have turned. <laughs> I was really close to the microphone there. Alrighty, we have three patients. We have Irvin and Cassandra and Jay. Let's start off here. Let's romance him. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and examine Irvin. And say hey. I hate how her gloves so much. Her scrubs. It's really bothering me. A lot, actually. A lot. I hiccuped. I know, it's great. Oh, did we finish? Okay, now what? I'm gonna give him some medicine. Liberty is saying hello. Hello, Liberty. Now we're gonna come over here to Cassandra after that. And examine her. And he took the magical medicine. And now hopefully he is all good. It looks like he is. Okay, we're gonna get over here to Cassandra. Hello, Cassandra. Long time no see. And uh, do the thing, do what it do, and then give her some medicine. And then we're gonna see Jay over here, our old friend Jay, who we also haven't seen in a while. And we're gonna go ahead and give him, well first we're gonna examine him and then we will give him some medicine, most likely. Oh, and she's playing some music for us. Yay, we treated all the patients. And now we go back to the hospital. Oops. There we go. That's some beautiful music, everyone. Can we go back to the hospital now? Cause... Okay, Cassandra's singing. Time to go back. She's gonna, like, eat their food. Uh, time to go back to the hospital, everyone. I'm ready to go back to work. No, this isn't... No, I need to get back to work. What is my game do Why are we not at work? Can we not go back to the hospital? Am I missing something here? Isn't our house in this area? No, it's not. <laughs> I'm wrong. Uh, go back to the hospital. Go back to the hospital. What am I missing here? Doesn't it just teleport me? Okay, well, she's going to go ahead and eat some of their food. No, I don't want to get a bad performance grade. I want to go back to the hospital. For real, though. Like, really. 
What is going on? Can I cancel it and then like go back to work? Maybe I'll do this. I don't want to. Um, I guess I'll Google this and then I'll be back. Alrighty, I Googled it and we're back. I think I'm really not smart in this part. <laughs> or just anytime. Let's be real. Anyway. Um, what are we gonna do next? Okay. Where is Gavin? I found him. He doesn't like us very much. We need to, can we diagnose him yet? What do you got here? Um, let's analyze the sample actually. Let's go ahead. No, wait, why, I don't want to practice analysis. Why don't we have his sample? Um. 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 <laughs> okay. Ooh, who's this? Is she new here? Jade? What's her name? Jade Styles? She's pretty. Ooh. Who's she? She's a doctor too. Let's go ahead and give her an introduction. Where did you come from? my dear. Okay, let's say hello to her. And should we try to guess what Gavin is? Oh, we started an element collection? Hmm. Oh, we found an element. Oxypin. Ooh, what is it? Is it worth? No, it's only worth 15 simoleons. Wonderful. Okay, should we just, just try to diagnose him? That's never worked well for me. Let's go ahead and discuss his general health. Oh, he's giggling, though. Oh, he's giggling. I'm gonna take a wild guess at gas and giggles, because, I mean, like, he's giggling. Come on, it's gotta be right. He's. Did you hear that giggle? People don't giggle like that for no reason. But I'm wrong 97% of the time. So, you know. We're gonna go ahead and give him some medicine, and we're not gonna go ahead and mourn Lori. Because I'm still not sure what to do with that urn. Paisley is back from school. Okay. Cross your fingers, everyone. Cross your fingers. And... Am I wrong? Oh, I thought I was wrong. Oh my goodness, I had a heart attack. Yes, we were right. Cool. Okay, we're almost to gold level. We just need to take care of someone else. Is this Kieran? Kieran is here. Who's this? Irvin. Didn't we just take care of Irvin? Come on, Irvin. Stop getting sick so quickly. We're gonna go ahead and take his temperature. I spit on my computer screen a little bit. <laughs> Casual. Okay, let's take his temperature, and then I think we'll be at gold, but we'll just go ahead and continue to take care of him. We'll, you know, scan his body, and we'll swab him for a sample. We made it to the gold today. Awesome. That should definitely help. What was that? Someone's like, no, no, no. Like, there's some complications happening. Oh my goodness, this girl is gorgeous. She, I mean, like, if she had a little makeover, what's her name? Jade Styles. Perhaps, 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 perhaps related to Harry Styles? No, I'm just kidding. Okay, wait, don't go mourn Lori. Did you swap him for a sample like I wanted you to? Nope, not that. Uh, swap for sample. Uh, whoops. <laughs> Lucia fumbled. Basically, we didn't get the sample. We're gonna have to do it again. Hello, Kieran. Thanks for the cash for a bakery we haven't been to in a while. Yeah, we're gonna have to do that again soon. Okay, we could stay late tonight, but I don't really want to. <laughs> Let's go ahead and analyze that. Where's Easton? Easton, like, isn't here right now. Weird. Anyway, ooh, are these two flirting? Is there some, some romance between Finnegan and Jade, perhaps? I think she's pretty. She could use a little makeover because uh, that lipstick is, isn't the best thing I've ever seen. But other than that, she's quite pretty. Quite pretty. Okay, come on. Analyze that. And we did it. Okay. We should be getting off work in just like 10 minutes. We'll just hang out for a second. Why don't we hop in here and save my game? Because sometimes things don't work out. Okay, we're going to go ahead and save it. And then our workday should be just about over okay i thought my game wasn't gonna save for a second and i'm like i swear if that happens i will be so mad oh dear okay we are about to be heading back maybe if i talk slowly i will fill up the space we got a vacation day too and 1235 simoleons yes i'm trying to press the check mark okay there we go 
I'm thinking, should we head to the bakery today? Did I say we, I said we got a vacation day. I didn't, I don't know what words I'm speaking. Um, I don't know what I want to do exactly after work. Uh, depending on how close Lucia is to a promotion. Let's look at that. Lucia, you are pretty close to a promotion. Oh, she actually doesn't work tomorrow. So we'll go ahead and go into the bakery tomorrow, I think. <laughs> And uh, I think what I want to do, maybe have Lucia go out. So we'll do the bakery thing tomorrow, not today. Let's go ahead and have you change into your everyday outfit. Yas, girl. <gasps> Work it. Okay. I keep saying yas. Does that annoy you? Is that so 2014? We're going to go ahead and have her travel. Um, and um, maybe we'll go to Ezra's house say hello maybe you never know with me <laughs> depends on if he's home where does he live again right here looks like he's home might as well stop in real quick you know say hello <laughs> totally not creepy or anything that would be weird and maybe we'll hang out with easton tomorrow too a little bit I kind of want to have like a mother-daughter day or even a father-daughter day basically a day where <laughs> What's her face? Oh, there. Ooh, I un uninstalled her hair. Girl. Yeah, you might. You might have to go ahead. We could probably. We could probably go ahead and change that right now, actually, because I don't dig this. <laughs> Testing cheats on. Did I type that right? I did. Okay. And I don't need the full edit mode for cast. So we'll just go ahead and put some hair on this girl really quickly because. She needs that. I knew, I, I was like, I don't use this hair that much. I should take it out of my game. And then I did, and I'm like, oh yeah, she was using it. She was using the hair, but I do have some new hairs installed. So I could do this hair. Ooh, that's kind of pretty on her. This color is kind of yellow looking on her. So I need to find, that's actually pretty. But <laughs> I want to try on some other hairs because I can never make a decision. Um, this is nice on her, but not my favorite thing in the world. This one's pretty nice on her. Um, there's one more. She looks pretty good, this one. I love this hair. I'm using it in my current household, too. And I love it. Okay, I need to use this one. Oh, my timer's going off. We're gonna <coughs> not choke. What about this hair? I want to try this one on. Uh, I don't like it on her. Okay, we're gonna give her this hair. Make sure it stays for all of her outfits. There we go. Yes, this is a close-up look at Octavia Francisco. Here's a close-up look at Ezra Francisco. He looks so much like a saying to me. Could just be me. Alrighty, we're gonna go ahead and hop on out of Create a Sim. We're just slapping a hair on her really quickly and have them chat for a little bit. Maybe, you know, they can eat some dinner together. I feel like right now Ezra... You know, he did own a, su su a successful business, so Lucia... Oh, we're playing the wrong household. <laughs> Alrighty, I fixed that situation, but um, I feel like right now Lucia is kind of going to Ezra for, like, business advice because even though she doesn't directly own a business, she kind of does. And that's kind of all it is right now, but I think she might be a little bit interested in him, but she's also pretty interested in Easton, so it's kind of a strange situation. But let's go ahead and get to know Ezra. Say hello there. How was your day been? Um, let's ask him if he's single. Just put a little bit of flirtiness out on the table. And let's have a deep conversation. Who is this? Do we know this guy? Kenneth. I think I've looked at him like a million times. I think he reminds me of another sim or something. I don't know. Let's tell an engaging story. Oh, not knock on the door. <laughs> Uh, let's tell a dramatic story. Did I already do that? Nah, we good. <laughs> that gas. Let's discuss their interests. Whoops. Whoops. And have a deep conversation. And then we will have them hug. And then maybe we'll go inside and... Okay, well first we have to knock on the door. And if they'll let Lucia make some dinner, then they can kind of all eat together. Just hang out, you know, as business partners. Am I right? Or am I right? Yes, we do need to get a promotion. I have to lock that in. 
Oh, and I bet they lost their wishes about having another kid with each other. I do... Whoa, I was loud. I do think Antonio and... Uh, um, hmm, Zoe, <laughs> if I could remember her name, should have another kid together, but I think I want to wait until I can make the house better so that we don't have to have a whole family living in a basement like they currently do. We're going to have her cook some... She's not a very good chef, but that's okay. Let's just make garden salad. You know, keep it very simple. Because like I said, she is not the best chef. That is Antonio. But she could probably figure out how to chops and stuff. No, don't grab some cereal. We are making salad and we're gonna have a nice family meal. What was that? She like yelled at us. Girl? Girl, we are making salad. I don't know how fond Octavia is gonna be of us because she's kind of like a little teenage. She's, she's a teenage girl. What can I say? So am I. What can I say? Anyway, make that salad, girl. Don't chop your finger off. Um, we got cooking skill level two. What an achievement, everyone. Why are you, like, yelling at us? Okay, maybe she's not. Maybe she's just having a civil conversation. Her hair is gorgeous. I love this hair. Whoa, we have shocked her. Ooh, they don't like each other. Stop picking your ear. You're making a salad. Oh, she just picked her ear and then stuck her finger in the salad. Oh, my goodness. Oh, dear. I'm disgusted. Ezra's here and he's eating his cereal with us. Well, this isn't exactly what I envisioned. Hurry up with your salad! How long can it take one person to make a salad? Are you almost done? We've been making the salad for about two hours now. About two hours. Come on. Come on. Okay, let's call everyone to a meal. Call everyone to the meal. I am going to pull my hair out. Okay, there we go. Now you can do that. There we go, and then we really should be out at home. But, you know, just a little, little kind of hangout session. A little hangout sesh. If I do say so myself, have them all talk to each other, get some dinner, and whatnot. Okay. Should we probably head to the bathroom, and then get going home, and then I'll be wrapping up this part. We didn't do too, too much in this part. Oh, I haven't even taken a thumbnail picture. Okay, wait. Right here. Right here. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm like... Oh, no. Can you open your eyes for me? Wait, no. Pause. I was gonna pause it when you had the fork in your mouth. Put the fork in your mouth. Did you finish your food as soon as I said that? Oh, my goodness. Just my luck. Just my luck. Oops. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. <laughs> open your eyes, please. And... Do you sell the fork in your hand? I want you to put the fork in your mouth because I feel like that'd be a good thumbnail picture. Hello, Ezra. Hello. Oh, that's it. What is this? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm doing either, but I think it's about time we wrap this part up right here. Yeah. Okay. Make sure to subscribe. I will talk to you all later. And yeah. Bye.